week, the community and students at East Carteret High School have come together to support the four students who lost their lives in Sunday's plane crash off our coast. Tonight, that support continued at the school's first game since the tragedy. News Channel 12, Shantia Hudson joins us live tonight in Shantia. What did that support look like? Many people who came to the game tonight saw this as another opportunity to help those families and stand together, Carteret Strong. From the players to the stands, the East Carteret High School gym was filled with camouflage blue and gold as a symbol of solidarity for families affected by the plane crash Sunday. It's just great to be a part of and great to show the, you know, um, endless support for Down East that all these families and parents and friends have shown so. Noah Styron, Cole McInnes, Daly Shepard and Jacob Taylor were sophomores at East Carteret High School and in their memory there was a moment of silence and prayers for their family. God on behalf of these families and the Down East and the Atlantic community and people who are connected all over Carteret County, God we come to ask for your help. We need your comfort. East Carteret High School's Booster Club also sold t-shirts and took cash donations that will go into a memorial fund in support of all the families involved in the crash. The athletic director tells me this is what the community stands for. It's amazing. It just shows the how, how huge this community is small in number but huge in heart and how everybody can come together and support each other, not to win a ball game, but to support each other and lift each other up in, in times of, of need. For this tight-knit community, it's all about standing together as one. You'll not find a better place on earth than the tighter-knit community here than Carter County and especially down east and the east side. All of the money raised tonight will go into a memorial fund for all of the families affected. If you're interested in giving, you can visit our website, WCTI12.com. In Carter County, I'm Shantia Hudson for News Channel 12.